Hello everyone! The topic for today's video is our Celestio application. We will look into the Celestio app. What is the main functionality it has and what problems for multi-channel sales it could resolve? Let's start with the installation of Celestio integration. You can find our app on the Shopify App Store. If you don't use Shopify, but instead use other platforms, please take a look at your platform app stores. Big Commerce, Shopware, or PrestaShop. Celestio is available in multiple plans. For a start seller it also provides services for free. You don't need to pay for Celestio usage if you don't reach $500 in monthly sales. For installing Celestio on Shopify, you will be needed to enter your store URL or log in with your store email. Then please click on the button Add to App. You will be redirected to the Shopify store page, where you need to review permission and grant access to the Celestio application. After this, please choose a plan corresponding to your needs and approve charges. Then you will be redirected to the main application page with onboarding steps. To make a connection between your Shopify store and the Amazon platform, you need to add your Amazon account. As we told you earlier, your Amazon account should have a professional package. Otherwise, it will not be possible to use any third-party integrations. For adding a new account, please navigate to the Accounts page and click the button Add Account. Choose your region and select marketplaces you would like to activate. Please notice that you need to activate only marketplaces where you registered. As soon as you add the account, you can request an inventory report for it. This reports a list of all your Amazon listings with a current quantity, price, and status. Using this inventory report, we can migrate listings to the management side of the Celestio app. So all further changes to QTY and price will also be reflected. The time for processing the report depends on Amazon loading and the number of listings you have in your Amazon account. The current status of the report you can find in the Celestio dashboard. During the time when we are processing the report, let's take a look quick look at the Celestio application. The profile section contains a list of settings for your Amazon account and listings. Global profile is responsible mainly for QTY and price settings and allows you to control how your quantity fields are fetched and what warehouse is used. Price settings give you the possibility to use a percentage margin on your normal store price. Also, global profiles are shared between all integrations, Amazon, eBay, and SD. Amazon Profile contains a number of settings related especially to Amazon integration. Like dispatching time or the possibility to activate GTIN exemption. Some of the settings could work only in combination with product creation mode. The functionality of creating a new product will look in detail in the next video. The creation profile is directly connected to creating new Amazon listings. It's also a topic for the following video. But in general, it allows you to create completely new Amazon listings, the same way as we did it in the last video on Amazon Seller Central. But this time we can apply shared data to multiple listings. Let's back to the inventory page. As we can see, all inventory data from the Amazon account is already here. Because we would like to manage it from the Celestio app, Let's move it under Celestio control. For doing this, we need to click the button Sync Inventories with Selling Products. This function will try to find all matches in Amazon inventory to Shopify products using SKU and then move them into a special selling list. And from this selling list, we can control the status of these listings. The process of connections also takes some time. In the meantime, let's take a look at the selling list feature. A selling list, it's a group of products combined with a specific set of settings and into a specific marketplace. For example, we will create a selling list with a collection mode and select one of our available collections. Then all products will be fetched from your Shopify store and added to this selling list. If you add more products to this collection, then these products will also automatically appear here.
now we can back to a newly created selling list from a migration feature. As you can see here we can find two of our t-shirts. The SKU for them is matched to the SKU of our Shopify products, so Celestio can make a connection and move it to the selling list. Inside the selling list, you can see that product is currently out of stock. This happens because Printify does not manage stock, but we still need to set it for Amazon listing. So let's do it inside the global profile and then custom stock to 99 items. Then we can trigger an update for listings and stock on Amazon will also be updated. The same applies also to the product. If we change a price for a Shopify product, the connected product inside selling list will be updated and Celestio will trigger an update for the Amazon listing. Another feature we would like to highlight in today's video, it's order synchronization. All orders you have on your Amazon account will be imported to Celestio and then if there is a match of the product also to the Shopify store. In this way, when you have a sale on Amazon for your Printify product, the order will appear inside the Shopify store and then Printify can pull it and make fulfillment. If this is not a Printify order, you can ship it on your own and change the status for the order accordingly. Regardless of how the order status changed to fulfilled, Celestio will catch these changes and automatically transfer the tracking code together with a shipping method to Amazon. This is all for today. We did a quick overview of the Celestio application and how it could help you with managing your Amazon channel. Order import, stock and price synchronization, it's a top feature used by merchants with Celestio. Next time we will take a closer look at Celestio's creation profile. And we will learn how to export new products with variations directly from the Shopify store. Sound interesting? Then subscribe to our channel to not miss new videos.